you are in luck because I have regained my sew mojo. So you can expect a lot of thrift flips and sewing videos. It's been quite a while since I ripped my husband's shirt. So today is the day. I'll be converting this old shirt into a dress. If you are someone like me with pear shaped body, you might want to wear the shirt and make sure you know the shirt at least ends just below your bum because we will be anyway adding ruffle to make it little more lengthier. But if you are fine with your dress being a little short, then you go girl. I am old but I am not that old, young but I am not that bold. So I prefer it a little longer below my bum. Let's get this done, shall we? First cut out the collar because we don't need it just like the way we don't need toxic people in our life. Next cut out both the sleeves. We will be using the sleeves to make the ruffles. After that remove the pockets because there is no need for it. Press it down neatly so that there are no creases. Fold the shirt and take out your reliable camisole or bustier and mark the neckline and armhole. After that draw a line from the armhole and till the end of your shirt as shown in the video and cut it out. Most of the shirts will have a curve at the end, we don't need that so mark a straight line and cut it. Sew it on both the sides until it's as closed off as your heart. Now take out your sleeves, cut the cuff and then cut on both the sides of the sleeves. You will get two straps. Do the same thing with the other sleeves then you will end up with four straps. Attach all these straps, you will get one long strap. Now to create ruffle, put a basting stitch on one side and double fold the other side. After adding the basting stitch, start creating gathers and this is how it look like. Once the ruffle is made, stitch on the side and then attach it to the bottom of the dress. Cut out a bass tape of 1.5 inches with any fabric. Now fold this and pin it on the neck and sew it. And then fold it inward and sew it. Do this on the other side and the back side of the neck as well. This is a quick project and you can do this within 2 hours. Do the same thing on the armhole as well. Fold the bass tape, pin it to the armhole, stitch it and then fold it inward and stitch it. You can use the same process to make a short top as well. Make some straps with the remaining fabric and then stitch it and turn it inside out to make shoulder straps. The thinner the straps, the more skilled you are at sewing. If it's not, don't worry, it's totally fine, even I am not there yet. Attach the straps on both the sides as shown in the video. Since there was a little gap from the neck till the first button, I ended up adding press button. The last step is to press every seam so that it looks neat and clean and your ruffles doesn't look weird and the dress is ready. There's many ways to be 